thought getting some buckets in transition early with our defense, turning defense into offense. If we're ever struggling to score, I think that's always a good way to start is on defense because then uh, you get some steals, you get some deflections, and then the other team's not set up, and hopefully you can get some uncontested layups uh, without having to work so hard for it in the half court. Yeah, it, it's a fun thing for the fans, and it's a nice thing to, to read about, but it's not something we talk about or um, you know fixate on. You know, We want to be as good as we can in the end, um, whatever that might be. We don't get into whether we're number one in the state or winning sectionals or winning states. Just the personality of the team because of their work ethic. Um, you know, there's some really good teams in the state that I know of that have been to the Final Four and the Finals. Um, so, I, you know, I appreciate the number one. It's not something we talk about or, or fixate on. All right, so there's Leah Bizon who's been on the team for four years now, and she's only a sophomore. Um, she keeps developing, and she has a humongous upside. Uh, she's our captain. Bryn Walzak, been on the team two, three years. Maddie Mulek, three years. Uh, Taylor Augello, it's her second year starting, and she's really come on this year. Um, she worked really hard in the offseason to develop her, her game. Uh, Maddie Howard, who's a senior, um, she'll be back soon. She was injured a couple weeks ago. She'll be back soon. She's a great, great assist person, very unselfish, um, looking to uh, defend and assist. Um, and then we have shooters like Adriana Long and Dakota Brinkman and Lauren Engel, who at any point could hit three or four threes in a game. And Kelly Mickey, who's a ferocious defender, and then Izzy Reiner, who can kind of do it all. Um, so we're really not a top-heavy team. Um, played Avon on Wednesday, and they're a good team. And you know, I definitely marked that down as one that um, I scheduled on purpose because they're a good, good program. And Pete Lee owns a great coach. Just got his third, three hundredth win. And um, our top two scorers had five points, and we, we ended up winning by twenty-seven. And I think that's pretty rare. Um, I can't remember the last time we lost by 27 when the top two scorers on the other team had five points. And I think that's just a testament to the girls developing and being ready at all times, um, no matter what uh, they did last game. Um, you know, next girl up when somebody's not uh, maybe at their best or injured or need a little boost.